In a significant cabinet reshuffle, Nigeria's president, Bola Tinumbu, has dissolved key ministries and also suspended six ministers of their duties. While this news broke earlier today, Voice of the People TV is on the streets of Lagos here to get citizens' opinion on this new development. I don't, uh, I don't fancy what he did because uh, the question is, why did you create the ministry in the first instance? Why did you create the, the ministry in the first instance? If you know that this ministry will not work or will not exist, why create them? and enable them to start co committing for a uh, fraud of uh, corruption it is it is uh, it is very very ridiculous for the go for the president to now dissolve it and he's not giving us any reason for it so what so what does he, he wants us to clap for him or what i don't understand we don't need that one whether they are dissolving a minister or not dissolving a minister we don't even need, we are not going to that way at all we are supposed to go into the normal way that they should they should make things dissolved for the poor people. The issue of Nigeria, um, I say, is tired everybody. I, I don't know what to say because this country, when this one comes, they will say you do better. Another person comes, they will say you do better. But things are getting worse in Nigeria, so I don't I don't just know what to say. They will be doing it on and off. In. I don't know if this one will be the same thing as usual. But what I know that God will help everybody in Nigeria. God will give give all the grace to live, to forge ahead. The proposed cabinet reshuffle has drawn widespread reactions from citizens across the country. Why some see it as a strategic move to boost governance, others express concern about the sudden changes. We'll continue to monitor this development closely, providing you with further updates. Reporting from Lagos, I'm Matthew Ogunswada for Voice of the People TV.